In today's video, we got 30 people that have 15 minutes to go find a random car on the road. As you can probably guess, they're going to bring that back to LSC and they're going to customize it. They only have 15 minutes to go find the car, then they have 10 minutes to customize the car. Okay, everyone, return your vehicles. Okay, everyone, I'm going to say 3, 2, 1, go, and then you guys can go run and find your pedestrian vehicle of your choice. You have 15 minutes. Okay, 3, 2, one go 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 and yeah you can go anywhere on the map to find these vehicles you just need to make sure you're back in 15 minutes okay so now i'm on the hunt for my pedestrian vehicle and i don't want to be next to any other player because i want a unique car if i be near other players there won't be a fresh new batch of cars they'll just be the same type of pedestrian vehicles of course in this challenge i want to be unique and i want to have something different to everyone else wait done you're already done it's only been two minutes i'm here just down the road passing the same vehicles again and again and you're already done then after eight minutes of searching it's already past halfway through the search time and i've only found the manana it's the most extravagant car i've seen it's really not going my way but then is is that what i think i see oh. is, is that a phoenix that i just passed well here's me turning around as soon as possible in this stupid manana that is not totally the manana's fault it's my stupid driving here but i was desperate to get that phoenix I want that phoenix. I've got history with the phoenix. Or is it just, will I get it now? Come on, come on, please, please, please. I want that phoenix as it disappeared. But thankfully, because of the PS5 render distance, it didn't get away from me. Here's me happily being satisfied with four minutes left. I've got plenty of time to get back to LSE. But then I see an intruder. An intruder. I have three different ones in my garage. I know how to make the perfect build with this thing. I was so happy I found it. Right, that's my final choice. I've got a great chaser build in mind. But I swear, it's like when you're not looking for anything, that's when you find stuff you want. Because then I found the Yuga Van. The Yuga Van is such a classic. It used to be a very underrated and surprising vehicle when GTA first released. The fact that you can make this a tuna van. And I think that is finally, definitely, 100% is what I'm going for. Right, with a minute left, I'm back at LSC. I, yeah, of course, someone has to bring cops. I guess we did like rob the whole of Los Santos, but you could have called cops off before you got to the meat spot. Okay, clearly this part wasn't going to plan, so we went all the way to the airport LSC to customize our cars. Once we got there, I announced that everyone has 10 minutes to customize their car. They all rushed straight to LSC. Right, we now have 10 minutes to customize our cars and I chose this car for a reason over the intruder because it actually has quite a lot of modifications despite the looks of it. It looks like it shouldn't have modifications but look, it's literally got an oil cooler at the front and that is basically it. That is going to be my build. Shall I go with windows or shall I take them off? I, uh, I am not too sure. Here we are. For the time frame everyone had, it, this looked like a pretty nice meat already. This looks like a normal meat. I wouldn't even be able to tell that the theme is just get pedestrian vehicles. They've pulled this off really well. There's a, a wide array of cars. I thought we we're all going to have like the same car because the same cars spawn everywhere. And you're probably thinking, how has this guy got a Banshee and customized it? Well, it's actually a Simeon vehicle. And I never said he couldn't do a Simeon vehicle, but he's like, could only change the color, of course. Many cars here. I've seen that's a second Schwarzer the Leicester car and we got another Yuga van I think is a great choice I mean I'm, I'm glad there's only two of us They're, oh we got a feel on that's nice to bring I oh that's gonna be one of my favorite ones right now and it looks like over here we've got all the sentinels parked because we've got a sentinel here we got a sentinel here oh that's really nice with that I think diamond blue is it called we got a stainer another sentinel another feel on oh, but that's got a pink pearl to it a goldner a schwarzer the only penumbra i think that is and the only radius no there was a lot of radiuses but no one picked it i guess <laughs> right best of show 2.0 First of all, we've got Creed versus me. So we've got 10 volts on Creed's car, brilliant looking car. We've got 11 on my car and 10 on Creed's car. Okay, we've got the Manana, which is a hard car to make look nice. And this is probably, I think this is the only one. And we've got the Felon. We've got nine on the Manana. We've got more than nine on the Felon. So we have a winner, the Felon. That looks pretty nice. Okay, we, now we have that gold Banshee, the Sivian Banshee. Let's not get in it before we get cops. And then we have 
There's the Yun, which is clearly, clearly the winner here. Oh, I really thought that this Stainer was going to win. I would have voted for this Stainer, but it seems like this Felon, it look, they both equally look very nice. Similar builds with similar wheels. But yeah, the Felon has obviously won this one. So, oh, well, we already see where this one's going straight away. But you know what? He deserves it because this is a very nice build for the Penumbra. And the Penumbra, he could have done so much more as well. If you wanted to, he could have put liveries on this thing. He could put loads of customizations that the car has. But he went for a simple, clean build, which looks excellent. So we have the Goltner versus the Felon. The Felon looks pretty damaged on one side. And then the Goltner, it's nice and clean, but it's still... This is very equal, actually. We need to wait a bit more for votes. We've got 11 on the Goltner, and then we've got we've got 10 on the Felon. So very close, but the Goltner still wins. So GG, nice job, nice job. Next up, we've got the Rocotto, I think it's called. And very unique. No one else has brought this vehicle. It looks super nice. And then we've got a Sentinel with that, I think, diamond blue and it. Yeah, it, it would be my choice as well. But this is another one that's really close. We've got nine volts here on the Sentinel. Then we've got 10 votes on the Rocotto. So the Rocotto wins and probably got butchered that name so badly. But yeah, good job. That was a very close one. Both good stance options, but I think he has lowered his sustainer and maybe that's why he's got majority of the votes. But yeah, the sustainer has won. We have the Gauntlet here and you probably think there's not a lot of people vote on it. Yeah, that's because they're all voting on the Primo and this Primo does look delicious. This is delicious oh my god what kind of an right i won't ever use that word again i am sorry but yeah that is really nice good job good job this is definitely a lot closer we've got the shafter here with white wheels and then we've got uh, a sentinel here with black wheels same wheel options again what is with this they've nearly the same color as well same <laughs> yeah the next car's gonna have the same wheel options right great job sentinel has won Okay, I didn't even get time to actually even do that one. Um, yeah, the Radius one. The Radius does look really clean. Right, we're back to the start again where all the winners, I think he's the only person who's not won yet. And then everyone behind me is a winner. As the SEO has won, I think. Oh, actually, I've not counted these people on the floor. Got one tooth yet. And I have been defeated. The Asia has won and rightfully so. It looks amazing. Oh, we've got another Yuga van now. And one, two, three, four. That is a lot of votes. But we've also got equally a lot of votes on this side with a nice Sentinel with those wheels again on another Sentinel. Similar color. Is this the same? This is the same one. He's cut in line. Never mind. Okay, yeah. And the Yuga van has won. Um, I'm seeing this guy shine a torch, but he's stand. Oh. That he's, he's gone now. But we've got a Sentinel on the left here. We've got another Felon on the right here. And it looks like the Felon's getting a majority of votes here. Next up, we have the Penumbra, which won by far last time. But it is up against a nice Felon now. So we will see who wins. Oh, the Penumbra easily getting the majority of the votes there. Oh, hang on a second. There is still... This could be a good competitor. Oh, this is getting more interesting. But... I think after careful evaluation, the Penumbra does have more votes. And of course, it's V-Dub. It's V-Dub again. V-Dub has a... I, I, I'm pretty sure I announce him in every video now. <laughs> now we have the Gauntlet from er earlier versus the Rokoto from earlier. I mean, everything's going to be reused here because these are all the winners. So clearly, we've got the Rokoto winning here. Easy win. Oh, this one looks like it's going to be a hard one. We've got the Primo. We've got this really nice Stainer as well. Uh, this is going to be a very hard matchup. Okay, I think we've got a winner. Uh, yeah, the Stainer has definitely won. That was a very nice Primo, though, but not enough to win that battle. Oh, we've got that Asia that versed me. So this is basically the winners of the winners. So here we have the third. Oh, wow. Okay, a lot of people going for that radius instantly. I don't think we need to recount this or count it carefully because the radius has won. Good job. Good job. Okay, on the right here, we have the Yuga van. And uh, on the left here, we've got the Sentinel. And what seems to be a very, very close matchup. But I do think, yeah, the Yuga has won. The Yuga's definitely won that one. Good job, good job. It's a hot, It's getting very hard now because there's a lot of nice cars now. Obviously, we've rendered out all the good cars. So it's good cars versus good cars. 
and oh the penumbra versus the rocotto which always has been winning the last two by far but no it doesn't seem like it's won this one because this penumbra is stealing majority of the votes and it's v-dub right now we have the radius belonging to mahmoud and a similar colored i think it's the same color uh stainer which it's a very close one again but i think sorry mahmoud you seem to be defeated here the stainer has got a lot more votes great job we are getting to the final three. Oh, so we have the yuga van here versus the penumbra and clearly the penumbra is just the best choice here i think it's well well we've only got three cars left yeah the penumbra has won and um it's probably gonna win the next one as well seeing the choices uh right come on the final two cars two very nice looking cars but yeah i think v-dub wins and v-dub uh, yeah I, I think i would have picked his car from the start as well but yeah it seems like v-dub has won another best of show once again v-dub is the winner great job congratulations to v-dub for being the best car here let me know if you do enjoy videos like this where it's a bit different and we actually have a challenge and yeah thank you so much for getting to the end of the video i don't know who does get to the end of the video but i'm still surprised to this day like people actually watch my video in the first place but getting to the end of it is a whole different story thank you so much for watching hopefully you did enjoy see you guys in the next one